like a dragon as well a, like a 10 minute story trailer and then another eight on I, top of that i feel incredibly conflicted about the like a dragon trailer because i was told don't watch that trailer big spoilers mm -hmm. i then watched the trailer because i don't give a fuck mm -hmm. and i understand what people were saying but mm -hmm. i feel like it's part of the game's premise Okay. Like, I feel like the basic premise of a game is not a spoiler. I mean, what I know is America, but like that, um, anything beyond that, I've, I clicked in and I started seeing some context and I was like, eh, yeah, I, I, I'd rather dodge. Yeah. You know, I, and now that I have a little bit more, like when I was completely in the dark, I could watch and let the whole thing wash over me. But now that I kind of know what I'm looking at a little bit, um, it's actually more dangerous for me to watch. So I, I clicked through yeah. a little bit and then and then avoided it. Um, um, I feel. I... Um, <laughs> there's VTubers in this game. Wow, as like yeah. main characters. Wow, uh, which is wildly appropriate. These games are topical, and then at the um, same time, like. In terms of spoilers or so, I, I think, like, I was also, I clicked on the, the Kiryu one, and it's just him being emo in a bar. <laughs> and I was like, oh, yeah, I, yeah, that, that's it. That's fairly consistent with the Kiryu's characterization. There's nothing else going on. And I was like, all right, that's, that sets the tone, you know? Yeah, I feel, I feel like uh, the, the things people warned me about were things that you would learn within the first sitting of sitting down to play the game, but uh, I've played every single one of these fucking games. Who knows? Um, I'm not going to, I'm not going to talk about it here. Uh, I do think that the story things that they're going for with Kiryu specifically are really smart in including him into this game. Um, I think going to America is incredible, especially Hawaii. Cause there's a large Japanese population on Hawaii. So Ichiban and Kiryu and them don't have to learn how to speak English. But they can have lots of I can't speak English shenanigans. Mm -hmm. um, I and, like. Go ahead. And uh, uh, fucking fucking Johnny Gat, aka Doctor Han, and Danny Trejo are gonna show up. Daniel Day Kim is gonna be there, and Ichiban's gonna look at him, and he's gonna be going, "I am a dragon." Daniel Day Kim. I am a <laughs> oh, I wish you understood what the fuck I was talking about. Anyway, I'm I'm done. That's okay. <sighs> um the uh I I like that for a while now there's been that little oh my god, he's he's gone. He's completely gone. Okay. <laughs> you just can't. I'm gonna be. Funny. You gotta go without me. That's okay. That's okay. I wish. I, I wish I was there, but uh, I, I don't. I don't know where we are. Um. No. The the uh, the 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 thing where uh, the 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 meme conversation of like man. When is Persona gonna make a game that's not that's for kids in college or adults grown up? Which we've had that we've had that conversation here, and then it turns out it's been echoed a million times elsewhere. And then like Catherine is like, oh, here's the adults or whatever. But for the most part, like all these stories about Japan in high school and and yada yada and so on. Um, the Yakuza franchise was not at all in this space, but now by becoming an RPG. 
and becoming an RPG about about a bunch of adults being fucking Hey, here's a bunch weirdos. of old guys. A bunch of old people acting like humongous weirdos and nerds and geeks. Ichiban's like, in his 40s and Kiryu's in his fucking late 50s. So Yakuza has become that RPG, right? The the like it was not an RPG before, but it just took that mantle of here's the here's the thing you were looking for with a bunch of adults with adult ass lives and problems. Uh, uh, being completely wacky, it's 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 pretty fucking it's pretty hilarious that they just kind of swerved for it because like no one was taking it, you know, and of course doing it and not taking it seriously at all were the summons of the fucking like every summon is just this insane like it's it, yeah it, yeah it's you the, see a bunch of you see Gary Buster Holmes' sister exactly. her, like protege it, and all sorts of the shit. crabs and the, like it's the perfect clips to drop on Japanese TV and have celebrities in the corner do their react faces to like it's exactly that you know um th any one of those little summons could be a commercial for a product if they held up a, a, a can at the end so yeah fuck it if uh, atlas ain't gonna do it if no one else is going in is, is is trying to hit that if we're all still going for high school then so be it Yakuza will take the fucking uh, uh, adults. Not RPG. Yakuza anymore, which is I'm having a lot of trouble. I'm having a lot of trouble doing. We've moved over mm -hmm. like a dragon. To like a dragon, mm -hmm. and a name change with a system change and gameplay. Like it, it, it's not. Yeah, it's true. Well, actually, it's extra confusing because like a dragon, Gaiden is actually just another Kiryu game. Yeah, with actual combat. But it's a side story to Yakuza 7, like a dragon, so... Oh. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Anyway, um, I, I, I appreciate that uh, that's how we got this, this type of game eventually.